Hello everyone, today I'm gonna talk about, actually one second, let me just do something first. Okay. Okay, that might be slightly better. Today I'm gonna talk about straightening the horizon on your pictures. Let's roll that intro. Alrighty, so in Lightroom, you want to be on the develop module, okay? And then you want to go to the crop tool, or you can also press R. And now you have a few options. You can either click on auto, where you see it here. You have the angle option, or you can do it manually. The easiest one, and oftentimes does a very good job, is the auto function. So basically, the tool will try to align the picture and straighten the horizon as it thinks it should be. So you just click on auto, and you can see, in this case, it did a really good job because to be fair there's plenty of lines at the background that will help the tool decide what the horizon should be so in this case it did an amazing job so yes i would accept this and then if this is the cropping that i would be happy with that's it job done move on to the next one okay and now i'm going to show you a different way of doing it which is the angle so when you click it you just draw a line click and hold your mouse and draw a line on something that you believe should be how the, the horizon should be straightened. So in this case, to be honest, there's not much to straighten. It's just a matter of doing a, a better framing of the picture in this case. So I'm gonna crop it even a little bit more to be honest. So something like this. But in this video, I'm just looking at the horizon, not much more to be honest. And then there's the manual way, right? The manual way is just you go to your cropping tool, you start to, to go in to do your cropping, and then you see at the at the very bottom there's two arrows, so you just move the the image until you have the cropping that you want. Obviously, I don't want that to be out of the picture, so maybe something like this. And then you can adjust it slightly, still looking at the background. And once you're happy, just press enter and off you go. So once again, easiest way to do it would be uh, the auto feature. It does a very good job usually. In this case, it didn't think it had that much to do. You see at the very top, I don't know if you can tell on the video or not, but it did actually straighten it just ever so slightly. So in this case, all you have to do is just crop. Now the framing is absolutely terrible or could be better I, uh, I hope I had more space here on this player on this side but that's okay doesn't have to be a perfect ratio so I'd crop it something like this and I'm still not happy I, I, I'm not happy that I don't have enough breathing space here on this uh, side but that's a separate issue completely we're just talking about straightening the horizon and now as a final example this one is a bit weird because it looks like it has two separate lines. So let's see what the auto feature will do. Let's just click on auto. I think it did a pretty good job to be honest. Let's see if I'm happy with the final result. Yeah, that's the thing. Because it has two, two different lines going in two different directions. It, it, it looks like it's straight and it looks like it's not. It's a, a bit of a weird one. But anyway, these would be the, the easiest ways to crop your picture and straighten your horizon. I think it's a very, very uh, easy way to improve your images. And it takes you almost no time at all. The more you do it, uh, the more you get better at it. If you want to do it manually, if you want to do it automatically, do it automatically. The tool, for the most part, does a very good job. And it just makes your pictures just look so much better. It's, it's one of the things that I, I don't enjoy looking at is a picture with a crooked horizon. I think it just takes two seconds to, to fix that and it'll make for much, much better pictures. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Now, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget, click that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Until next time, take it easy, guys. So long.